hello sir hi sir yeah. so so far what we have seen in this topic you forget about everything right now i what i am discussing just focus on that if you are getting that you will come up with nice expression i am sure okay so just be with me for 2 3 minutes you will come up with nice expression you will be amazed after looking that expression okay i will play with some vector and the other stuff okay see this is not beyond the imagination see i, I have already forced you to imagine about the level curve in you know, in the in previous diagram i already forced you to imagine about the level curve about the gradient vector so we'll play around that thing only we'll play around that thing only just hold for a second okay so did you understand the level curve basically did you understand the level curve the level curve is obtained when we cut the object with horizontal plane yeah. at certain height at certain height right we'll get a curve what we'll get we'll get a yeah we'll get a curve that can be projected on x y plane it basically yeah it basically the cross section what cross section level curve is like the cross section of cross an section. object yeah cross section level curve is yeah. what the you know the pathways you get along the object right along the surface that is what the level curve yeah, is yeah, yeah. okay so we simply cut the object horizontally that's important we cut the object we don't cut the object like this right we cut the object horizontally okay at certain height so we will get a level curve that is projected in x y plane so the equation we are talking about of the level curve here okay so the equation of level curve can be written in terms of parametric Right? because we are not sure the exact figure of the level curve level curve curve could be anything but obviously we can define the level curve based on the parametric equation i have put one example which is circle so that you can at least relate the thing uh, the, I, I should not, I, I, it is not necessary to give you the equation of circle in parameter i should have told directly but at least if you relate the thing that we can find out the equation of curve in terms of parametric equation so it will feel better that yeah something we have already talked about isn't it so right. this is the parametric form of the level curve now see what see first of all understand this x could be anything in terms of t if i am writing this way uh, you know some i don't know why you are confused see if i am writing x is equal to some e some equation in terms of t anything like that y is equal to some equation in terms of t anything i am I'm, i'm not sure about the equation but this is how we can represent the parametric form isn't it yeah yeah cool yeah that is fine okay cool so now i am putting see this is on the level curve this point is on the level curve so obviously this will satisfy the equation of the object right this is on the level curve because this define the level curve basically so this will satisfy the equation of the object so i have put this in the equation of the object here so f of x y is equal to z so if i put the equation like x of t y of t in the equation of the object so that is equal to c because that is the whole idea behind the level curve you are getting the equation of level curve you are putting it in the object then that is certain height the z value is the basically at certain height right so that is c are you getting that see we have already discussed this in reverse order yeah we we got one function f of x comma y yeah. is equal to z what is the level the question was what is the level curve what is the level curve at z or c is equal to 4 this was the question we already discussed in reverse order we discussed then we what we do we put so what we do we put c is equal to 